Hey everybody, this is Melanie Brown from Courtney Lane Designs and I have a new tutorial for you I'd like to share with you today. This one is how to make sure your letters are straight when you cut out a sentiment or a title for a scrapbook page. Um, this is a problem I've had for a long time. It looks great and then um, I put it together, glue it down and stuff's crooked. I hate that. It drives me nuts. I'm sure you guys have had the same problem. I've seen lots of um, different ways to fix this, but this is what I do, and it's pretty foolproof um, as long as I do it. If I don't do it, then there's problems. Okay, so we're going to type, um, let's say, um, um, hello. Oh uh, no 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 let's do let's do something more top topical let's see happy father's day okay all right so i'm going to line it all up and then i'm going to come over here and i'm going to center it and then i'm going to change the font now i'm going to change it to a, a font that looks really good that when it comes directly onto the mat. It is, uh, what's it called? Boys Will Be Boys, I think. And I just like the way it comes to the mat and it's a good example of wanting to duplicate this exactly. Okay. All right. Well, not that one, not the arrow one. Let's do the other one. Okay. All right. So see, it's kind of whimsical and kind of, you know, the, the things are not 100% straight, but it's on purpose and it looks good. Not like everything of yours is straight except for the E <laughs> and it doesn't look good. Okay. So what I do is then I come over here to insert shapes. This is a new feature that um, Provocraft have added and I have all these shapes I can use and they're free so I'm going to use a square because let's say um, I'm going to make a let's see let's do an A2 size card so that would be let's say four or five point five by four point two five All right, so now I've got an A2 size card. And I'm gonna make it white just because I like to be able to see. All right, I'm gonna move Father's Day to the front. All right. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select all and I'm gonna slice it. So now I have the words that I want to cut out, and I also have a template for it. So I would just lay this down onto my card and then glue down the letters inside, and it would be perfect. Alternatively, what you could do, and this is something I've been doing a lot lately because it's super easy, is to not cut out the individual letters at all, just cut out um, the Happy Father's Day that's sliced through the rectangle and you have an instant sentiment and then you would just back it with your blue or whatever color you want to use paper. So this is pretty easy too because there's not a ton of gluing. The only things you would have to glue down are the little centers to the letters. And there's not that many in, in this particular sentiment, so it'd be pretty easy. Anyways, that's all I have for you today. If you have any questions, please let me know. Otherwise, you can see me every day over at Courtney-Lane.com where I have tips, tutorials, and projects almost daily. Take care, everybody.